My father was taken in the middle of the night by Mohammed Ziad Barra's regime. Eventually, he was returned to us, but Barra's men had poisoned him for refusing to join his regime. The scars of living through civil war, surviving abuse at a young age, losing my father all remain with me. In fear of our lives, my family fled war-torn Somalia to the slums of Kenya where we spent nearly four years in refugee camp waiting with hopes to come to America. From Somalia to Minnesota, my family and I were welcomed as legal American citizens. America had saved my life, the land of opportunity. Inspired by the events of Black Hawk Down, I joined the military to give back to the men and women who gave their lives so that I could have a second chance. I served over 10 years as a United States soldier. I was deployed to Iraq where I fell in love with a fellow soldier and gave birth to three beautiful children, but they lost their father to PTSD and the pains of war. My husband was a different person that we no longer recognized. It wasn't easy surviving domestic abuse and taking on my newfound role as a single mother, struggling to care for them. At one point, homeless, living in our car, poor and tired. But my hand is not out. I still believed in the American dream, resistant to become helplessly dependent on a system I have seen vulnerable communities and so many of my brothers and sisters become enslaved to, rather than empowered to truly prosper in the land of the free. Our lives, our pride, and dignity can no longer be bought in exchange for votes that only keep the elite in power, who disappear and abandon us after election season is over. The self-aggrandized political class who do not represent the people. My name is Shukri Abdurrahman and I'm running for Congress in Minnesota. I am a survivor, a refugee, a mother, a black Muslim, but above all, I am a Minnesotan and an American, just like you.